Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Barrett Parkman to the main stage. Good morning. Good morning. It is my absolute pleasure to be with all of you today. My name is Barrett Parkman. I'm co-producer of the conference. I'm v vice president of GWC. And also, I'll be your host for this morning's section of content. It is my delight to be with all of you here today for this very first global mobile internet conference in Silicon Valley. I truly believe we have a very unique experience for all of you over the next two days as you'll make unique global connections and learn about global markets all over the world. As many of you know, this is our very first event here in Silicon Valley. However, this is our fifth overall global mobile internet conference. The previous four were all in Beijing, where we've become one of the largest and most influential mobile conferences in all of Asia. And it was actually our speakers who came over for that conference from Silicon Valley who actually gave us the idea and the vision to bring this conference here to Silicon Valley. They told me that, specifically, there is no other conference that was in Silicon Valley that was providing the level of global content and global connections in the mobile industry that we were providing there in, there in Beijing. So with that, we started the, the goal and the vision of bringing Jimmy Silic Silicon Valley here. And now we're excited to be here with all of you here today. Our goal, we felt, in order to really uh, fulfill our vision of really bringing the global space right here to Silicon Valley for two days, we needed at least 5,000 participants from at least 40 different countries. This was a very ambitious goal for a first-year conference in Silicon Valley. And actually, about three months ago, when I told people of these goals, people laughed at me, honestly. But today, I'm delighted to say that we have well over 8,000 registered participants for this conference across eight different stages. And they're from 42 different countries. Over the next two days, we'll have 200 speakers speaking on eight different stages across every range of topic in the mobile space, covering every significant geography in the world. However, none of this would have been possible without one certain person, our next speaker, who is the CEO of GWC, whose first dream and vision was to connect the mobile leaders of the world. His name is Win Chu, the CEO of GWC. Please welcome him to the stage. Oh, so big conference. Hello, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's my honor to welcome you to our first Jimmy KSV. I am Wen Chu, the founder and the CEO of Great World Club. We are happy to have you here today. I would like to thank all the participants, attendees, and sponsors, the speakers and moderators who have worked with us to make this conference reality. I'd like to take this opportunity to share three brief stories about GWC and how Jimmy KSV has come to be. Now, my first story is about GWC beginning. I was in Tokyo, Japan in 2008 with a group of delegates from Chinese mobile internet companies who wanted to learn more about the Japanese mobile internet market to meet with and learn from successful companies like Gray and DNA. But it was difficult for us to visit with them because we didn't have the relationship to, have a dialogue, to, to open a dialogue. We realized there should be a more communication, understanding, and cooperation between China and Japan mobile internet industry. After several trips and eventual meetings, we find out that this wasn't just a need for Chinese entrepreneurs, but also Japanese entrepreneurs wanted to know more about China and the Chinese market. That's why we are here. We are here to bridge mobile internet markets around the world. Today, GRI and DNA CEOs are among our network of the top mobile internet leaders and a number of Japanese mobile internet companies have located a branch office in China. 
the second story. Last month, Tencent and Xinlang, two of the China leading mobile internet companies, strategically invested in GWC. The investor marks a, a momentous event for these two computer, computing companies. According to the investor departments, this is the first core investment case for them. Tencent CEO Pauli Ma, Xinlang CEO Charles Cho are among a number of top leaders who are supporting GWC development. They recognized that GWC is making meaningful stride in reinforcing communication and cooperation in the mobile internet industry. Today, I, let me introduce the CEO of Xiaomi, Lei Jun, who was the first angel investor, first to believe in our vision, and whose support has helped GWC grow year after year. We have worked hard these last four years to bridge the Asian mobile internet market. Today, we can proudly say that we have created a network of the top mobile industry leaders from China, Japan, and many others leading market to provide unique opportunities for cooperation among our members. Now we came to Silicon Valley. Hope to build a last, lasting bridge for mature cooperation that will not only help introduce more Chinese mobile internet companies to the world, but also we to help more mobile internet companies from around the world expanding into China. Lastly, I'd like to share a story about an entrepreneur who had the vision of the bring people together from the many epicenters of technology. The man is me. I'm a Chinese entrepreneur who had the traveled very little outside of China before establishing GWC. But my entrepreneurial journey and experiences reinforced the vision to help introduce Chinese companies to the world and help more mobile internet companies to expanding to China. I mean, very, very fortunate to have a strong, dedicated, and a diverse team whose joint efforts are turning this vision into a reality. We hope that GMIC will pro provide a unique platform that brings the world entrepreneurs, developers, and leaders in the mobile internet industry together to forge new relationships, partnerships, and future corporations. Thank you. Thank you, all of you. Thank you very much, Minshu. And that's all for a man who three years ago spoke zero English, honestly. So it's really impressive, right? Our next speaker, our next speaker is, is a very special guest we have with us today. We have today with us the mayor of San Jose, Mayor Chuck Reed. So please, everyone, put your hands together and welcome him to the stage for him to come give us a welcome address. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to San Jose, the capital of Silicon Valley, the innovation center of the world. We're the number one patent filing city in the country. We're surrounded by other top 10 patent filing cities. So you're in the right place to have this conference. We're really glad that you brought the conference to San Jose. We're a global city. Nearly 40% of my people, of a million people in San Jose, are, nearly 40% are foreign born. And of our tech companies, uh, over 50% have foreign born founders. So we're a global city. We benefit from the innovation that happens around the world because people from all over the world come here. They bring their talents, their desire to build a better life, their willingness to work hard, and they have success here, and we welcome that, we appreciate that, we celebrate that, so we're celebrating the fact that you're here, we appreciate what you do, and I have uh, one request 
from the people of San Jose. We were the number one city in the country last year in terms of job creation in our metropolitan area. But number one is not good enough. As you know, you got to keep moving. So I want you to spend all your money. Max out the expense accounts. Max out the credit cards. Because i got people who need work. And as long as you're here, you might as well have a good time. So thank you for coming. We appreciate it. Have a great time.